So today I'm in Frio trying to look for, or actually a pretty birthday present, <laughs> like a card, and then hopefully gonna go to the beach and do nothing. Because <laughs> this is finals week, last week here and stuff. Apparently they don't have CVS's and stuff, so you have to go to a print store, and I think I just found it, to get a birthday card. <laughs> I don't know what card to get this person. <sighs> That's funny. <laughs> I literally just went into a store to try to chew to get so that I could go buy it home in the US for cheaper. <laughs> yeah, I love doing that. And look at the colors of blue. <laughs> this is like a park thing. <laughs> Seagulls. I can't believe people are swimming in it. So I guess I could go for a swim if I wanted to. Alright. Here is a closer view of the ocean. It's gonna be super sad to go back to the Atlantic Ocean. This is the Indian Ocean, by the way. Yeah, 70 degree weather. And this is their winter. <laughs> Australian winter. It's Tuesday, and then I leave this Saturday at night, Saturday night, and I'm back Sunday. And then I'm home for like a week and then I have to move again. <laughs> oh, jet lag, it's gonna be fun. But I'm really looking forward though to seeing my family and definitely some friends. Um, a lot is probably gonna happen. Oh, I only get two months off. I mean like a month and a half off and then school starts again in the fall in America. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be a really short summer, but Technically, I guess this is kind of summer, so, <laughs> you know, I was in Australia for like four months. God, went by fast. And then I'm a senior in college and we'll graduate. Yeah, no, but I figured out kind of like what I want to do with my life over here and stuff. Definitely grown a lot. It was like a really good experience and I definitely recommend it to anybody if they have the opportunity or money you know, to go travel abroad, definitely. Because it does change your perspective on like how you look at your own culture and stuff like that. And it's interesting meeting new people and stuff. Um, like, kind of looking back on Americans now, like a lot of people are like closed-minded in the sense like they haven't been out traveling out of the US. So like they don't understand kind of like other people's perspective. They don't like have any like you know, empathetic understanding what I mean, like people know that like, the U.S. doesn't have the best health care and like stuff like that, but like we, all right, not talking about Trump. Like I'm glad the way that I was raised and I'm glad, I'm glad to be raised in America because um, it seems like a lot of people here have to get into adult life really fast and everything and like you have that time in America to like if you go to college and stuff like that for your college then you have that time to figure out yourself and what you want to do with your life so like that's really nice and it works for uh, it worked for me might not work for some people because I definitely know people in college that should have taken a gap year or should have gone to trade school or like community college and then seen where they are because definitely like if you don't kind of have a tentative plan for after college you're just gonna move back home with your parents, which is not what I wanna do. Um, I wanna go to grad school. But also America has pretty much probably the best education system in the world. In terms of public education, obviously depends on region, but um, like colleges, like we do, like <laughs> significantly. <laughs> Don't recommend Murdoch to anybody, unless you're probably going to vet school or chiropractic school. Um, probably depends on your major, yeah. 
but ah. Uh, I will say though that it has been definitely a break from academics from Clark. <laughs> Clark's a really good school and really glad I went there for the academics because that's probably the main thing that I really love about it is like, <laughs> yeah, I know I really love my major. <gasps> uh, it's the psychology classes there. Ah, and definitely something I wanted to do like when I graduate and stuff like something to do with the psychology. Um, yeah. So, probably gonna be the last vlog, um, kind of thing. I'm gonna put up a post that was gonna be kind of about, like, a written, like, reflection about what I've learned. I kind of talk about it, because I talk about, like, friendship and, like, relationships and stuff. And definitely I've learned a lot about that over here. Um, and, like, definitely, like, a lot of value in that when I'm bringing back and everything to the U.S. Like